แบแบบแบแบบแบบอีแบบแบบแบบแบบอีแบบแบบแบบแบบแบบอีเย่เวลแบบแบบแบบแบบแบบอีเย่แบบแบบแบบอีแบบแบบแบบแบบแบบอีเย่ on triple T and I'm back Hey guys, today I am having Taiwanese beef noodle soup, which was from my friend Freddy. So without further ado, I am going to get into this. Oh, it's not much soup, but I'm gonna add a bit of water. Big, 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 big again. It's your boy Triple T, and I got for y'all some. Beef noodle soup. This is from my garden. It is um, some Thai or not Thai uh, Vietnamese coriander. So I added that in there for a little freshness. And this was my friend Freddy brought this by. He was Taiwanese, and it's been in my freezer for a while now. And I have no food, so I thought maybe I should eat this. Mm. So, mm. Mm. oh my god, oh. Bit salty, but mm. oh my god, gosh! Mm. Oh, um. So yeah, today I'm gonna be doing story time with this uh, meal here. Now, okay, where do I begin? Okay, let's start from okay last night. So last night. I, the last few days, I've been sitting in my apartment, and there's been this foul smell. I'm always felt smelling this foul smell. And at first, I thought, you know, oh, it's, it's garbage, or somebody hasn't thrown their garbage. Then, I started smelling this really gross smell, and it's like smells like old dirty farts. So, I moved my sofa and there was a dead mouse. Now, oh God, sorry. Um, so, okay, where do I tell, how do I tell this story? They're getting too excited here. So, uh, there was a mouse in my restaurant. It's downtown. It happens, right? Um, so this guy, this Uber driver, taps me on the shoulder, and he's like, um, and there was a mouse sitting on the end of the bar, and then it ran across the bar, and... Anyways, I know this may sound weird, but I think I may have brought this mouse home. I think it may have crawled in my bag or something. I don't know. I have no idea. Because I live on the seventh floor. Like, well, I live on fifth, but there's two parking garages, so it's like seventh floor. So I'm like, there's no way it could, how would it climb all the way up here? And so I think it, big again, so I look like shot, let's get rid of this hat, um, so this isn't pretty good, I'm glad I ate this, it's a free meal. So yeah, so anyways, that night I came home. And the same night I saw the mouse at the, at work and then I was sitting on my sofa and I thought I saw out of the corner of my eye something move along the floor, along the floorboards. And I'm like, oh my God, did I just see a mouse? And so, yeah, I don't know. I think he got trapped here. I don't know. 
he didn't have any food to eat and he died, I guess. But I was upset because I didn't know what to do. I have a really bad gag, a smell thing. It's a mental thing where, I don't know. So once I saw it, I was focusing on the smell. It took me two hours to clean it up. Called my landlord. He said basically that it wasn't his problem. He said, this is, it's not my job. So as soon as I heard the words, it's not my job, I hung up on him. It pissed me off. Oh, it's not your job. Well, I'm calling also to let you know there was a dead mouse in my apartment. It's disgusting. Then I text him, whatever. That's what I said to him, whatever. And then I blocked him. Sometimes when I get angry, upset, I've been known to say things that I'm going to regret later. So I was like, block them before you say anything. But anyways, I didn't. Hmm. But I'm just like... Really? So yeah, so it took two hours for me to clean this up. I puked like three times. I had just done an A&W mukbang. Like maybe an hour or two before that. And I basically, all my dinner, sorry guys. Then, so what's your guy's opinion? It's his responsibility, kind of. But that's people in the world now. They don't want to help you for anything. It's me, 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 me. Selfish, selfish, selfish. Heaven forbid. Like, I swear to God, I bet you if I got stabbed and I cried out for help in the building, probably nobody would help. Probably nobody would call 911. I could probably go out right now and fall flat in the street and probably nobody would do anything. They'd probably just look and let people run me, run you over. Then, because I'm a dum-dum, look into my bank account because I told my landlord to take out the rent on the 4th. I look. I was like, why am I minus 500 something? I put the wrong paycheck. Deposited wrong paycheck. So it bounced. Oh my god. Then I realized, oh my god. I... How I managed to do that Guys, I will never know. I will never be able to tell you what goes on inside this skull. Mm. Those are good, but they're very salty. The I think this is turnip. Not sure what this is. When I made mine, I didn't make mine with this. I think it's a turnip. It's good though with it. Just a bit salty. All right guys, so that was my story time. And, yeah, I don't think I, no, oh, I didn't take any, I didn't do any thumbnails. I'll never check. I do all these thumbnail poses and then I never check. One of my viewer was like, I miss your intro, because I was getting lazy. I'm just uploading the video, not even. 
not even put anything together. Oh, that was salty. Mm. Oh, I hope this doesn't bother my stomach. I was really hungry, but I hate eating before I have to work, but I don't work for another, I don't know, probably three or four hours. Oh. Oh, that's a bit too rich Whoa. and salty well, thanks for watching guys thanks for joining me on another triple T mukbang peace out much love to you keep a cool tool and never let anything loaf uh. oh pardon me